This video is from the Starlights Incorporated installation video series. In this video, you will be shown how to properly install the Revolution T818 with the patent pending harness technology into a generic 18 inch typical RV fluorescent fixture. The patent pending harness incorporates a plug which allows you to install the lower portion of the harness into the fixture with ease. Please follow the following instructions for a trouble free installation. At this time, remove power from the fixture, remove the lens and the ballast cover. Locate where the power wires enter the fixture cavity. Typically, those wires enter through a small hole in the roof of the fixture as illustrated here. Locate the fixture ballast. It is most often mounted in the center of the fixture attached to the roof of the fixture as shown. Locate the fixture ground wire. It will be the wire that enters through the roof of the fixture and goes directly to the ballast. This wire in most cases is white in color. Locate the input power wire. This wire enters through the roof of the fixture and in most cases goes to the switch mounted within the fixture. If the fixture does not have a switch, then it will go directly to the ballast and attach to the black wire that is soldered to the ballast. Locate the fixture switch. The switch will be pressed into the cavity of the fixture. In some cases, it may be necessary to remove some shielding to access it. Locate the switched power wire. This wire will be mounted to the switch opposite the input power wire and go directly to the ballast. Remove the switched power wire and bend it as shown as it will not be used in the installation. For fixtures with a single tube, connect the harness as illustrated. Press the new switched power spade connection on the new harness to the blade connection on the switch. Connect the harness ground. You first have to locate the ground wire that goes from the ballast into the fixture. It's usually a white wire. Cut that wire bend over that part of the wire still connected to the ballast, the other part of the wire connected to the harness using the wire nut provided. At this time in the installation process, route the new harness to a position where it can pass under the ballast cover once it is reinstalled. For those fixtures with dual tubes, connect the harness as illustrated. Press the new switched power spade connection on one of the harnesses to the blade connection on the switch. Cut it leaving approximately two inches still attached to the spade connector on the switch. Cut the spade connector off the other harness and attach the wire from each harness to the wire attached to the switch with one of the wire nuts provided. See illustration. Being a double tube fixture, we need to take the ground wire again and cut it that part of the ground wire attached to the ballast, we want to bend it over as it's not going to be used. Take the other part of that wire that comes into the fixture, attach it to one wire from each of the harnesses with the wire nut provided. At this point in the installation, route the new harnesses to a position on each side of the ballast cover where they will pass under the ballast cover once it is reinstalled. Replace the ballast cover, threading the harness or harnesses out through the opening between the fixture and the ballast cover. You may have to bend the ballast cover slightly to gain clearance for the harnesses. Take care not to place the harnesses against any sharp edge that may cut or chafe the harness. It should be noted at this time that the ends of the T818 tube twist to correctly position the LEDs to project the light into the room efficiently. Any adjustments that need to be made should be considered at this time. At this time, take your new Starlight's Revolution tube or tubes and place them into the fixture. Take the harness or harnesses on the tubes and plug them into the harness or harnesses protruding out from underneath the ballast cover previously installed. Tuck the harnesses in behind the tube and replace the fixture lens. And thank you for buying a Starlight's product.